Uh, just very quickly, Jan, thanks a lot. Um, it's an amazing event. You're doing a tremendous amount of uh, work for our ecosystem. Uh, it's a pleasure to be a sponsor and to give back just a tiny little bit and to tell you guys where we stand with Sunfire. My name is Niels, CEO of, uh, of Sunfire, and what we do is we develop and produce industrial electrolyzers in order to bring renewable energy to hard-to-abate sectors. Um, the year 2020 was uh, the breakthrough year for hydrogen, in our opinion. The European Commission decided to uh, put forward its hydrogen strategy and to set a uh, concrete target of 40 gigawatt of electrolysis capacity to be installed in Europe in 2030, which corresponds to a market potential um, of up to 18 billion euro. Uh, Twelve months later, the European Commission followed up with a Fit for 55 package and has included a substantial number of uh, regulatory packages in this Fit for 55 package supporting green hydrogen and electrolysis solutions. Um, the other point is that the industry has followed up. I think there is no energy company in Europe anymore that doesn't have a hydrogen strategy somehow. And considering that there is maximum five to ten good electrolysis companies in this industry that can actually deliver industrial equipment, and Sunfire is one of them, we think that this is an amazing investment opportunity. Um, this is the two products that we're offering. On the left side, you see our pressurized alkaline electrolysis, which is a uh, state-of-the-art, robust, cost-efficient device, which you can sell at 100 megawatt and larger with commercial guarantees to industrial customers, and that's exactly what we're doing. Uh, we actually signed a contract yesterday, 10 megawatt, fairly small compared to uh, a lot of the tenders that we're engaged in right now. On the, on the other side, you see our solid oxide electrolysis, which is uh, the next generation device, substantially more efficient uh, than conventional technologies, and since efficiency and electricity prices are key to total cost of ownership of hydrogen production, uh, this device is going to be uh, uh, the device for the future. The other big benefit of this uh, solid oxide electrolysis is that it can not only turn water into hydrogen, but also carbon dioxide and water into so-called e-fuels for planes and ships. Based on Sunfire's technologies, uh, over 70 projects have been realized in 24 different countries with more than 250 megawatt of installed capacity. We have a production capacity of 50 megawatt um, per year installed right now and an opportunity pipeline of more than 3.5 billion euro. Uh, and a lot of those opportunities that we're negotiating right now are tenders that are going to see their financial investment decision in the next uh, six to 12 months. So real traction in this amazing market. Um, the core that we offer is the electrolysis. If you're uh, an industrial company and you're sophisticated enough, we can sell you the pure electrolyzer. Together with our partners, we also offer turnkey solutions. SMS Group helps us to do everything also at the, the construction site. And very selectively, we also engage in joint ventures and SPVs and invest a bit of our own money in order to develop projects like Norsk EFU in Norway, or a project that we're doing with Total uh, in, uh, in Germany. And at the bottom, you see a couple of the projects that we have been realizing in the past uh, 11 years. Now, what's the next step? Uh, Sunfire is currently uh, very concretely planning the scale-up of its production to gigawatt scale. This looks a bit like a, uh, like, like a 3D drawing that, that we came up with. This is actually um, a, a, a true factory that exists that we want to integrate our production processes into. Um, this requires that we finish our Series D round of financing at the moment, um, but is an amazing opportunity for scale-up with a partner who knows how to industrialize processes. And the German government um, has offered 150 million euro to Sunfire in order to support uh, that upscaling process. So if the Series D works out, uh, if the governmental funding comes, next step is to scale up to gigawatt and be ready with at least 50% of that capacity in 2023. Um, part of the team you know already, uh, two new people came on board in the past uh, 12 months, uh, 18 months actually. Our COO, Bernhard, who used to work for Jabil, Zöllner, and other production experience uh, companies, and Stefan Garabet, who was for, uh, formerly um, CFO of a division of Infineon, and before that an investment banker. 
We're more than 250 people. We're going to reach 300 through an acquisition by the end of this year. And that makes us the number one electrolysis team uh, in Germany, definitely, potentially also in Europe. You see a bunch of partners, and with the clock ticking, I come to my last slide. Um, if you haven't noticed, hydrogen is the answer. Don't bother to find out which question uh, this relates to. Um, hydrogen is coming. It's becoming commercial. Um, you see a couple of reasons why to invest in Sunfire. Um, we're closing our Series D round of financing in the next six weeks. We have two amazing lead investors. And if you're super fast and can invest 10, better 15 million euro, um, come and see me and we can discuss. Thank you, Jan. All right. Thank you. Do you, do you remember that the first Sunfire pitch was in 2011 at our second Eco Summit? I do, and uh, it was embarrassing, but I learned over the 10 <laughs> years. Thank you. <laughs> Fortunately, it was given by your ex-CEO, Carl Berlin. That's true, my not, first not time was... <laughs> then it was great. <laughs> I meant my first. But this company is really going through the roof, and the answer is hydrogen. Forget about the question. <laughs> I like this very much. Cool.